Hey guys, it's Casey, also known as Miss Freddy, and today I am sharing a big secret. I occasionally use Photoshop to do a head swap to make a perfect photo. I am a family photographer, and specifically I specialize in families that have young children, and so on occasion, the children don't always cooperate and smile for the camera at exactly the same time. So um, I'd say on average, once or twice a session I do a head swap. It's not something I use a ton, but I do it to get the perfect photo. Um, so I'm going to show you today how I do that. This is an example. I did this at my mini sessions last winter, and this is a sweet three-year-old and his little sister who's one. And this picture is very cute, but a second later, he decided to give the sweetest smile, and she looked down. So I wanted to combine her smile from this picture, his smile from this picture, and ultimately give us this perfect photo. So I'm going to show you how I did that. Um, so I opened both pictures. And I'm going to select her head from this photo and control C, copy. I'm going to go on to this. I'm going to zoom in. I'm going to paste her head. And I'm going to try to just move it somewhere close. Then I create a layer and I reveal all. And I take the paintbrush at 100% opacity and I start to clear away some of this new face. <laughs> so it looks like I'm gonna have to move this right about there to make it match up a little better. Oh see I kind of move it as I go. Delete more and more. painting to get rid of all this. Too far. Let's see if I can alter her head a little bit. Okay. So once I have it fairly close. This a little bit more. Then I then I dial down this paintbrush a little closer and I clean it up. So I'm gonna flip it to white, which means I'm painting her new face back on. Around the edges where I accidentally undid them. Okay, so that looks pretty good, but I need to fix even smaller. I'll dial this back in to get nice and close to her face here. Paint that off. Move that over because it will work a little better. How's that looking? I do a lot of off and on, off and on, off and on to see how we're doing. And I look for spots to kind of change to reveal that I forgot to delete them. So there's some here. Paint that all away. There's some above her head. Where else? Some right here. I'll zoom in on things like this and make sure that that line looks realistic. A little bit to clean up here. And then there's also a little bit of a shadow behind her ear from where his sleeve was. So, I don't really like the way that looks around her neck, so I'm going to paint some of it off. Put the 
There we go. So just to remind you, this was the original image. This was his original smiling image. And then this is after the head swap and after I edited the image. How cute are they? If you enjoyed this video and would like to see more in the future, you can subscribe to my blog at MissFreddy.com.